This brings us to the third way we can have a thanksgiving thankfulness from Psalm 100, which is in the second part of verse 2 that proclaims, Come before him, singing with joy. Now, for some of us, Psalm 98 verse 4 may be more applicable. Make a joyful noise unto the Lord. And that we all can certainly do. Have you noticed something, though, in these three thoughts of thanksgiving thankfulness? Our Almighty God is telling us, I want you to be happy, so shout with joy, serve and worship with gladness, and sing with joyful songs. Now, turn to the person beside you and ask, are you joyful? Do they look happy? They should if they're listening to this message. Verse 2 in Psalm 100 tells us, worship the Lord with gladness. Come before him, singing with joy. Well, that phrase, come before him, comes from the Hebrew words boponim, which has a context of someone coming before a person of royalty and bowing down in acknowledgement of their authority. When you worship the Lord, do you come before him with an attitude of respect and reverence, singing with joy? Friends, that's how we need to be if we truly have a thanksgiving thankfulness towards our Jehovah God. 